This is IKMC International Kangaroo Mathematics Contest and we are solving problems for pre-equality class 1 and 2 for the past paper 2020. Question number 23 is 6 different numbers chosen from 1 to 9 are written on the faces of a cube. One number on each face, the sum of numbers on each pair of opposite faces are equal. What we are going to find is which number could be on the face opposite to the face with the number 5. Options are given below. Option A is 3, B is 5, C is 6, D is 7 and E is 9. So what we are going to do uh, initially is that to elucidate the statements of this question. The first statement is 6 different numbers chosen from 1 to 9 are written on the faces of a cube. Most importantly, what we are going to check is there are only 6 numbers written on that cube, which that cube is exactly equal to the dice. So, 6 different numbers are written, but we have to choose it from 1 to 9. So, leave 4, 5, and 8. Other numbers we are going to choose it for the other sides of that cube. One number on each face. The sum. Now, this is very important. The sum of numbers on each pair of opposite faces are equal. First of all, we need to understand this statement. Suppose opposite faces. What are the opposite faces? So, uh, we are going to take 5 as an example. That is on the upper portion. And opposite to 5 is the downside. The downward portion. These are the opposite faces. And when you are going to add the numbers which are written on the opposite faces this must be equal to the other side other pair of the opposite faces so here we are explaining it again one to nine numbers can be chosen i have explained you earlier that only we can choose the numbers from one to nine the second statement which I have written is 4, 5, 8 are already taken. So we can choose only other than these numbers which are 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 9. Here 4, 5, 8 is chosen. So remaining numbers are what? 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 9. We have to choose only these numbers. Some of the numbers on the opposite faces must be equal. Some of the numbers like 5 opposite to that number must be equal. The answer of these numbers, like the sum of these numbers, must be equal to the 8 plus its opposite side number must be equal to that 4 plus the opposite side of number. Like this, 4 plus opposite number, we don't know right now, is equals to S. S is for same. Now, 5, its opposite side is the downside. And 5 plus the number is equals to say S. S is for same. Now 8, 8 plus its opposite side. The arrows are representing the opposite side of each other. So 8 plus that number equals to S. S is for same. So S like all the numbers when are when these are added to their opposite faces numbers, it must be same. Here I am writing from 1 to 9 because we can choose only these number the numbers from 1 to 9. 4, 5 and 8 are already taken. We are not going to uh, choose that numbers. But else than that. As in that numbers are 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 9. Now there is a trick. The, you have to be very um, focused upon this thing. Because this is an important trick. Numbers from 1 to 5. 5 must be added to its closest number. The next door number is 6. 5 plus 6 is what? 11 and 4 plus 7 we know that 5 is bigger than 4 so 4 must be not next to that number but 4 must be the number which is already chosen for the 5 move to the next number 4 plus 7 for 1 to 5 we are going to add numbers in the next section the forward side section so 5 plus 6 is what 11 and 4 plus 7 is what 11 now here we are moving for the 8 we already know that 5 plus 6 is 11 4 plus 7 is 11 so 8 plus 3 is what 8 plus 3 is what 11 the trick is that for moving from 1 to 5 you have to add the numbers from the right side to the forward counting but when the number is getting bigger like 8 is the big number you have to move back to the smallest number because we cannot take if we take uh, 8 plus 9 or 8 plus something else it must be like 9 because we are here we are only these numbers we which could be taken 
सो एट प्लस थ्री इज इलेवन एंड फॉर स्मॉलेस्ट नंबर फ्रॉम वन टू फाइव यू आर मूविंग फॉरवर्ड एंड लुक एट दैट फाइव इज अ बिगर नंबर फ्रॉम द लेफ्ट पोर्शन यू हैव टू मूव टू द नेक्स्ट नेबर नंबर एंड फोर इज स्मॉलर दैन फाइव बिल्ड मूव टू द नंबर विच इज़ ऑलरेडी टेकन फॉर द फाइव एंड फॉर एट यू हैव टू मूव बैकवर्ड्स सो ऑल दिस थ्री नंबर्स विच आई हैव टेकन ऑल द नंबर्स आर ऑल द आंसर्स आर सेम सो दिस इज़ आर करेक्ट लाइक मैथड बट सपोज वी आर गोइंग टू टेक समथिंग एल्स नंबर देन लेट्स सी मे बी वी आर वी गेट द आंसर डिफरेंटली लेट्स चेक आर आंसर डेट वेदर वी आर करेक्ट और नॉट now 5 we are going to uh, we cannot take four number so we are moving backward 5 plus 3 is what 8 but 8 is what we cannot choose 8 so we are not moving backwards because we need 8 we need the sums bigger than 8 so this is wrong and for this question hope you will understand the importance of the statements so answer is what we, what we are going to find is which number could be on the opposite uh, on the face opposite to the face with our number 5 the number 5 in its opposite side is the downward side for the number 5 what we have chosen 6 answer is what 6 answer is what 6 uh if you find any problem in this question or any ambiguity then you can do comments thanks bye bye